A lot of collaborations or mergers have failed or are still trying to imitate what the Renault-Nissan Alliance pioneered 13 years ago. In an industry of scale like the car industry, the Alliance has made Renault and Nissan stronger together. Just think for a moment of all that would never have been possible without the Alliance. Without the Alliance, would Renault and Nissan be global companies? Would Renault or Nissan alone be present in the emerging markets? At a time when being global has become key to maintaining growth. Would Nissan have got such a fast start in Brazil 10 years ago? Without being able to use the Renault Curitiba plant to launch its first models? Would Nissan and Renault even be in India without the very first joint plant of the Alliance built in 2010? Would they have a chance to attract local suppliers without the promise of significant combined volumes? Would Nissan be able to use the capacity of the Togliatti plant in Russia? And would Renault be in South Africa? Without the Alliance, would Renault and Nissan be as efficient? Would Nissan have gained market share that fast in many major European markets without RCI Bank? Would Renault or Nissan alone be able to negotiate with suppliers without the Renault-Nissan purchasing organization? Without common logistics and customs, would they be able to save millions a year in transportation costs? Without the Alliance, would Renault and Nissan have developed their best-selling products? Would Nissan be in the LCV business today without initially building on Renault's best-selling models? Would Renault and Nissan have built some of their most emblematic cars? Would cars like the Qashqai and the Duke be possible without the Alliance industry leading powertrains that the market demands? The Renault-Nissan Alliance is the only major cross-cultural partnership in our industry to stand the test of time. It's the only one that survived multiple business cycles and the only one that keeps growing. <laughs>